Hey Level Up ladies, it's yours truly Joshi and welcome to the Level Up Podcast where I help aspiring young females level up to the boss they High always dream to be. you from low quality experiences and that's how Mary had a little lamb. <laughs> that man for the streets, okay? <laughs> Either you're gonna boss up or stand down, move forward or stay stuck, no failures, just lessons, the level up does not stop based on how you feel, sweetheart. Hello, girlies. Welcome back to another episode of the Level Up with Joshio podcast with your girl, Joshio. And we are in for the Brokey series. The Brokey series is a series of episodes that I give you different analogies on the broke man. I give you the, the tools and the necessities that you need in order to repel a broke man. And as we continue the Brokey series, and it's going to be a very short series, I just want to say right now is going to be the most anticipated episode on why you should not date broke men. And you know what? I have told you what broke men may tell you. I have told you what broke men will do. I have told you how broke men act. I have told you what broke men say. But did I tell you what the broke men do to you and why you should not date them? Now, I know a lot of people say it sounds so superficial. You shouldn't date broke men. Would you let your daughter date a broke man? Would you? Because these men be forgetting that they also have prerequisites as well. Do not allow pick me's, pick me's, pick builders, make builders, whatever you want to call them, make you believe that you are wrong for wanting a man that can provide for you financially. And this doesn't mean that he can own a private jet. This just means this man is able to sustain the bills in the household for you and your children to have a comfortable life. And I'm going to tell you why broke men and high value women, high pergamous women and women that are, are, are aspiring to have a soft life do not go hand in hand. And in order for you to demand a man that has an abundance, you need to be an abundant woman. You cannot come here half step in. So if you want the six-figure man, you're going to have to be able to have conversations with a six-figure man. It's not saying that you're going to have to make six figures yourself, but you have to have some type of value to this man that at least he can say he is proud to have you on his arm as he go out there and make the money. Insecure men push you back in life. Insecure men push you back in life, and most insecure men are broke men. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, broke men are insecure men. And I can tell you something. You don't want to be in a relationship with an insecure man. You will lose, part of my language, you will lose your fucking mind. You will lose it. You will lose your flipping mind. I'm telling you, broke men push you back in life. The reason that I tell you don't like broke men, and I'm not just talking pockets, I'm talking financially, I'm talking mentally and spiritually. Men, money, and their ego go hand in hand. When men decide to marry a woman, they they genuinely and intensely feel they can provide for you. If a man feels he cannot provide for you, he will not marry you. And I don't think they tell us that. That's why I don't recommend you building men. Because then you become a placeholder because in that building process, he is not going to give you that, that marriage you want right there and then. And it's going to be a possibility after he gets where he is. He may not want you no more. The reason that I tell you why you should not date broke men is not for you to be superficial. For, it's not for you to feel like your shit don't stink. It's not for you to feel as if that you are high maintenance. The reason I tell you don't date broke men, because they break your spirit. Because they are broken. Because a man's ability to provide and protect in society is what makes him a man. I don't make the rules around here. That's just how it is. A broke man is an insecure man, and insecure men project their insecurities on you. He will turn into the man that says that you are always looking at the next man with money. He will turn into the man and say something to you like, oh, you probably going to leave me. 
he will turn into the man that doesn't want you to get too far ahead of him because he is scared that you are going to leave him and find better. These are the things that broke men do. I only telling you do not date broke men because what is going to happen to you during that time is going to cause you to sit down and figure out what it is that you want to do with your life after you leave this broke man. The number one reason you do not like broke men because they are very insecure. The next reason that you should not like a broke man, broke men are very jealous. They are jealous of their woman. They are jealous of the men looking at their woman and they are jealous of other men. If ain't nobody never tell you this, you don't want to be around a jealous person. Jealousy is worse than the grave. Jealousy is what is caused wars. Jealousy is what is caused deaths. Jealousy is what is caused the backbiting. Imagine being with a jealous man because he has no money and he decides to make your life miserable. Broke men, number three, miserable. When you don't notice that when a man's finances ain't right, he's get antsy. Imagine a man whose finances is not right every single day of the week. That means he antsy every day and he applying pressure to your life every single day. I don't tell you I the reason that's why I don't want you to, to be out there building men. Because you can you, you can have to go through those seasons and it's not a guarantee it's gonna be a reward at the end. Okay? The reason that you should not date a broke man, it is because he can never secure a future for you and your offspring. Why are you having babies with men that that I don't understand this. For me personally, you really shouldn't be having kids if you cannot provide your child with a better life than yours. And if we have to actually have kids determining when we have a better life for them than us, it will require us to actually be more productive human beings. It will require us to actually work harder as human beings in order to provide this life before we bring a life into this world. Having babies for broke men don't guarantee your child nothing in this world but another struggle. Having babies for broke men don't guarantee you nothing in this world but a life of struggle. You shouldn't be having kids for men that still has to put you on the bus to get to the doctor appointment. You shouldn't be having kids with men that can't afford to give you a ring and a wedding. It makes no sense. Stop investing your life into broke men. Broke men are insecure. Broke men are jealous. Broke men can't guarantee you no future for your offspring. Broke men can give you nothing but misery because he miserable. The reason that I'm telling you not to like broke men is to save your psyche. Not the things that you manifest physically, but the things that go on in your, go on in your head mentally. Broke men make you broke in spirit. They make you tolerate the things that you thought you would never tolerate. They make you always operate from a place of lack. Something our parents did. Some of our parents did that. Broke men would have you operating from a place of lack all the time. Every single time. It would be no we can't. And don't get me wrong, it's a difference when you have to, when, when you're saying no for a sacrifice for something better, such as like getting your investment property or getting your home or saving for your child's college fund. Those are, those are no's that we understand. But when a man telling you no for everything, even the simple things in this life, and there's not a major sacrifice that is being made for us to understand why we're saying no in this moment, you will always think from a place of lack. Broke men have no vision. So when a broke man doesn't have a vision, he has no vision to lead you anywhere. Broke men will lead you nowhere but a bedroom 
and a bed. Because that's all they have to offer is dick. They have no future to give you. They have nothing to give you. This is why you don't date broke men. Another reason you date, you don't date broke men. Broke men can't invest in you. He cannot invest in you. He can't invest in your dreams. He can't invest in, in, your, in your aspirations. He can't invest in your goals. I don't want to be with no man that can't invest in my dreams and goals. Because in order for him to do that, he had to invest in his first. This is why, honestly and truly, I can tell you, girly, is a broke man will have you working harder. Because you're working harder now to sustain him and yourself. And if you were fool enough to have a baby for him, you're working to sustain the baby. Broke men don't give you soft life. This is why you don't date them. This is why you don't date them. They have you operating in masculinity and harder. You don't date broke men. You don't date them. There's no benefit from dating a broke man other than being front row seat to watch struggle. And if you are a broke woman, and I'm not saying just financially, if you are a broken woman mentally, physically, and emotionally, work on yourself. Because when you are a woman that is making money, or when you are a woman that is, that is, that is, that is abundant in your mind and everything that you do, you can make decisions like this. You can make calls like this and say, I don't want a broke man. Because at the end of the day, these men don't care about our money. They care about how we present ourselves. And in one of my episodes, I think I'm, I said or I'm going to say, in order to attract money, you have to look like money. Broke men will have you never looking that way. Broke men will always have you looking like Cynthia from Rugrats. Broke men will have you working harder. Broke men will have you doing role reversal. I wish somebody would have told me this before I invested my years into broke men. There are also broke men that are very nice. And they are nice because they know within themselves they don't have nothing else to offer. Beware of those. He is still a broke man. I spent my early 20s building broke men. And I am with none. I am with none. A stingy man is just a step, a step, a step closer to a broke man. Don't date no dingy, don't date no stingy man. Don't date a man that is cheap. He will be cheap with you. If he cheap with himself, what do you feel he would be with you? Do you really feel as if that's why you have to look at how these men carry themselves? Broke men carry themselves a certain way. That's why they will make sure that you carry yourself a certain way. And it can be harder and much more detrimental than how he carries himself. A broke man can't give you a future. He can't invest in the future. He makes you miserable. He is insecure. And he is a jealous man. So if, if, if you feel as if you're going to get somewhere with your broke man, you need to tell me what's happening. So we can see if this is worth it. Broke men only can give you empty promises, no actions. Especially there are broke men that are always talking about they starting a business and they never started broke energy. You don't even have you don't even have the faith to bring stuff to fruition. Broke energy. Moving along. Girl, at least I only telling y'all this because somebody didn't tell me this and I learned my lesson. If I could do for me and you can do for me what I do for me. You ain't for me. I'm going to say it again. If I could do for me, and you can't do for me, what I could do for me, you ain't for me. You ain't dating broke men no more. You are not dating broke men anymore. Get it with your mind. Go after a man with a career. Go after the man with the business. Go after the man with the investments. You deserve it. And if you deserve it, you can start acting like you deserve it. You're going to carry yourself like you deserve it. Put abundance into this atmosphere. You have not because you ask not. 
You were not put on this earth to suffer without cause. The struggle is real. Get out of the struggle. These are the reasons why you don't date, like, entertain broke men. A broke man will always leave you broken. Thank you for tuning in to another episode on the Level Up With Your Shield podcast. And I will see you girlies later. Bye.